We're tracking even more breaking news tonight. Officers shot someone in Phoenix. Ryan Sims just got to the senior 40th Street in Thomas. Ryan, what can you tell us? Yeah, Lindsay, by all indications, the night is just getting started with this investigation. We know that because of the presence of these RVs, big RVs in the middle of the street. There are two of them here. They are mobile command units. Whenever there are cases with just so much evidence, instead of taking all that evidence back to the police station, back to the crime lab, they take the crime lab here in terms of these RVs. Now, as for the scene itself before the RVs arrived, we shot this footage earlier. What we know is not much because a media specialist hasn't arrived here yet. But what we are told is that officers arrived here for some reason earlier tonight, about an hour ago. And when they got here, they say that a man was in a front yard of a home and he had a gun to his head. When police tried to get that man to stop to put the gun down, they say that he pointed the gun at them. Witnesses here in the neighborhood say and tell me that they heard three shots. Uh, that man is still alive. He's taken to the hospital. We do not know how, how badly hurt he may be, but there is a lot of activity still going on in this neighborhood. Again, a lot of unanswered questions, including why, uh, again, uh, police responded here. So we're trying to figure that out. Having said that, though, neighbors tell us that, unfortunately, scenes like this all too common. We are told uh, by one neighbor, in fact, that her home has been broken into three different times just in the last few years. And she says that it is common here to uh, hear police helicopters circling above. Live in Phoenix tonight, Ryan Sims, Arizona's family.